I did this on my channel. Hey fiddle. I know it's Friday. And I usually do Friday face, but I'm doing a little different video. I wanted to do. Um, I want to show you palettes that I already had shades gone or pans. Now I have one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine palettes that's been panned. I have some shades that are totally finished today. Pan two shades today. I have a palette and I'll show you what I'm wearing, the palette that I'm wearing. One of them is my Milani palette. I panned, shockingly, this brown shade and I'm very happy. Hopefully, um, I get another shade pan out of here. And I'm very excited about that one. And they say I don't use makeup around here. I just don't use it up. Well, um, there's proof right there. My next one is the palette my son bought me. It's the BYS Peach Palette. I bought it because I was thinking it was kind of like the Too Faced Peach Palette a little bit, but it's not. And then I thought about the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. It could be a dupe for the Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette. But you can tell that shape is pink. I love it. I do want to use up these palettes that are pan. So most of the palettes I'm going to be using when I do my um, shop my stashes or choose monthly palettes. They are going to be palettes that I do have a pan in or shade finished up. Because I do want to pan some more in there. I have this one. I have this one on my Amazon wish list again. I finished off this shade. So I'm happy about that one. This palette is so, so gorgeous. I have it on my Amazon wish list. I do want to buy that palette again because I do like that palette. Um, another palette was this one my stepdaughter got me, the Color Workshop Love Struck Eyeshadow Palette. She got me this bit for Christmas. First, I was like, not for me. But I was like, hey, it's free makeup? Shut up, girl. And I can two shades out of here, so I do want to give this one some more. But if the shadows on these palettes are stinking, I will be pitching them like I've done some other ones. I had two Juvia Space palettes that I already had hit pan on. I had to throw them away. They stopped. This one. Yes. Let's get pan on that yellow shade. Lay down. Lay down. Go see mama. And I have my grab palette, another ship palette. You can tell what palette I like. And I pan the green shade first. I have the beautiful. But I'm not really keen on the black shade. But if I have to say, this shade here is going to be the next one. I'll probably be putting that in a shop my stash when coming up, when it's time to redo the um, spa day palette, I'll probably put that one in there. And I have my Too Faced Sweet Heat palette, you know this is my favorite palette, this is one of my most favorite palettes I do have, I would die if I lost this palette, oh my god would I die, it took me forever. Smells like peaches. The container smells like peaches. It still smells like peaches. I have pan two shades in here, and this one's almost done. This one looks like um, these two shades I do use. It looks like this one probably the next one pan, or maybe this one it depends. I haven't really touched some of these shades. Some of the shades you look in here, and you see I've used some of them. I have not used like these three. I don't think I've used. I don't think I've used a shape yet either. Oh my god, but I love this palette so much. Next palette, this is my yearly palette for the year. I mean, not yearly, for the month. Um, for next month, month of October. 
I chose this palette. I did pan a shade. And I will be doing, when I do my spotlight palette, this will be the spotlight palette for next month. For the whole month. So every Thursday, I'll be doing a new look with this palette here. You see, I pan this shade. This does have blushes in it, but I'm not going to use the blushes. I'm kind of thinking about decluttering, depotting the blushes out of here. If I ever get a Z palette and put them in the Z palette and just have the eyeshadows in here. Will I repurchase this palette again? No. But I did pan this shade here. And this palette was two dollars and fifty cents at your ninety-nine cent store. It is a good quality palette, it is pure neutrals. But I think I could do a look with this, and I may use some of the blushes for an eye look as well. I know it's neutral, but to be able to do different looks with these, it may be easy, it may be hard. I was trying to do a confusing palette, and this one's kind of confusing. So, I mean, you have pretty shades for the corner of your eye, you have pretty shades for everything, but let's see what we can do. Next month, this month is almost over. We have one, two, three, four, five, six more days until next month, and this will be that monthly palette that will go. And I've already got it sitting up here on my vanity. This is the palette I used on my eyes today. I can say most of the palettes you see here now, the Color Workshop palette, I don't know if you can get it again, I do not know. I'm not for sure about the Milani palettes, but I have seen them on Amazon. So if they're on Amazon, I'm sure you could probably get them. You'd have to go to Milani website. Um, for Beach Cosmetics, I don't know if you can still get this palette. Hello, you see? Right there. Hello. But this was the shade palette I used. And I used this shade in the corner of my eye. It was already panned. No, I panned this shade today. That's right. I panned this shade today. I pan this shade today. I started out with the black shade down here on the bottom of my eyelid. And then I wanted something different. So I went in and used this shade in the corners of my eyes. And then I was like, okay, let's find another shade to use. And then I think I used this shade. And I did use this shade. Too. But then I put this shade on top as a topper shade, and I was like, oh wow, I'll pan that one too. And so I was very excited to get that pan. Those are the palettes I panned, or I have shades used up. I think I'm doing a good job. These are the main palettes that I'm going to actually put together. I keep my Pat McGraths together, <laughs> but I'll probably do it. These are some of the palettes. That I definitely want to keep together and use up as much of it and pan as much of these I can. And not just, you know, I want to switch up with some of the other palettes as well. But I want to use these too. I use some of the other ones. But I'm going to put these separate on the shelf. Separate than the other ones. Now when I, and I want to take any new palettes I start buying. Um. I do have two more coming in the mail I ordered, but um, I want to take the new palettes and put them separate. They need to get used, yes, I need to use them, but not, you know, use them right now to pan. They will have a date on them, like, I have one Julius Face palette, I bought it on the 22nd of May, which was, my husband got it for me for my anniversary. Um, these two Julius Place palettes here, and you and I got them on 8 5 of 2020. They had these together where you could get both of these palettes for $25. And that wasn't bad at all. And I went and bought them all. And if I'm not going camping, I'm not going on the trip, but if I was, I was going to take this palette. I keep saying I'm not. I don't want to, but we don't know. The truck's like, I said, the truck was in the shop. So we'll figure that one out. So I hope you enjoy this video. If you do enjoy this video, then give it a thumbs up. And hey, if you want to make this video your own video and go make one and show hands that you hit progress on, 
go for it. Until next time, I love you guys and hope you have a wonderful, blessed day. Love you if you're new to my channel. Welcome, welcome, welcome. And just give me a 30 day free trial. I gotta show you. Okay, guys, I have to show you something that is so cute. Isn't she adorable? Sitting here, sleeping. I put a pillow under my desk so she can come in here with me and sleep. She is getting bigger. Both ears are all the way propped up. She's so adorable. Okay, guys, enough of that. Good night, time. Bye, guys.